Arthas Menethil, son of King Tyrannus Menethil II, the ruler of Lordaeron. As a promising young paladin, Arthas was trained in combat by Muradin Bronzebeard and learned the ways of the light under Uther the Lightbringer. Soon after his induction into the Knights of the Silver Hand, a plague gripped the Northlands of Lordaeron. I joined Arthas to help investigate an insidious disease that caused the dead to rise again. After fighting the infected undead, we encountered the necromancer Kel'Thuzad and discovered his plans to infect outlying villages under the orders of the dreadlord Mal'Ganis. We set out to stop the demon before he could reach his next target, the city of Stratholm. But we arrived too late. The citizens had already consumed poisoned grain that would doom them to rise into undeath. To stop the plague from spreading further, Arthas ordered his knights to purge the entire city. Uther and I were horrified and refused to obey his cruel command. Those who remained loyal to Arthas joined him and began the culling of Stratholm. Arthas sought vengeance upon Mal'Ganis, but the demon slipped away to the frozen land of Northrend. While leading his forces in pursuit of Mal'Ganis, Arthas came upon his former mentor, Muradin, searching for a powerful blade called Frostmorn. When the sword was found, Muradin read its inscription and warned the prince that the weapon was cursed. But Arthas believed that the blade would give him the power to save his people. When the weapon broke free, a shard of ice struck Muradin down. Heeding the call of Frostmorn, Arthas claimed the sword and left Muradin for dead. With Frostmorn in hand, Arthas confronted Mal'Ganis, who told him the voice he was now hearing was that of the Lich King, Ner'zhul. Obeying his new master, Arthas slew the Dreadlord and abandoned his troops as he pushed deeper into the frozen north. When Arthas returned to Lordaeron, the kingdom rejoiced at the homecoming of its beloved prince. But that joy turned to ashes when Arthas entered the throne room and ran the accursed blade through his father's heart. Arthas scourged the land in the name of the Lich King, Ner'zhul. To reach the throne of his master, Arthas had to face Illidan's storm rage. After a grueling battle, the victorious Arthas ascended to the frozen throne. He drove his blade through the ice, releasing the spirit of Ner'zhul from its icy prison. The two beings merged into one and became the true Lich King. Should he rise again from the frozen north, all of Azeroth will face his wrath.